I hope you guys are doing well tonight. It is, as per usual, another session of late night gaming. I hope to get at least some, a little bit more pop work done, but uh, no promises. Because, I mean, players, but we will see. Hope that we get stuff done today. How was everybody's day, evening, morning, mm, any of those? Better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Yeah. Well, that's one of Zenobia's gobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. Incendio! resource indeed your field guide i'm most pleased to be included about them no <sighs> we'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, 
That's one of Zenobia's cobstones. I hardly see what all the fuss is about. places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Revelio. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. On another adventure, are we? Pretty late, it's like uh, 2 29 in the morning, so 
everyone would be asleep by now, I would say. But I'm doing very well. How are you? Now. But surely those were curdled. Oh. the whole it's your whole series <laughs> rebellion lumos Getting in a little bit of Harry Potter and before I go to bed. Good that morning, is what Professor I'm doing. Garlic. <laughs> How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, a little treat for your auntie. Ah, oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. Ah, oh, thank you. How thrilling it is to have everyone back together again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in Herbology is knowledge. The prudent Herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bowl. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the Mandrake Root. Akio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Now, everyone, grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Oh. Reparo! I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right, then. Off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now for our next task, Rebellion. we'll be planting Dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. Yes, Professor? Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. 
Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting Dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Picked them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful. A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. It wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Niffler's fashion is restorative. I should think Professor Garlic would be more careful with her mandrakes. Pardon me, Professor. What am I supposed to do with the Dittany seeds? Your part in all this flaw. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld Potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear and let them have a good chomping.